Thankfully, it's November, and Appalachian Wireless is offering the Samsung GS8 or the GS8 Plus for $100 off the regular price with two-year agreement. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless and East Kentucky Network Company. I learned that everything is possible. Sixth grade students at Pikeville Elementary School have spent the past six weeks gearing up for their fourth annual Living Wax Museum. The project is for Jaytana Hall's reading class. She says the Living Wax Museum teaches students about biographies, autobiographies, nonfiction, reading for information, speech writing, and editing. At the beginning of the year, students randomly selected their characters. We've spent like six, seven weeks on researching print pictures, and we've had like three or four speech outlines. We've had a poem. And then when it's all done, we glue it on a big uh, trifold board. You learn a lot about how to research and how to write a speech with stuff you know, and how to present stuff and how to make presentations and how to talk in front of people. My favorite part was probably um, putting my board together and um, just saying my speech and memorizing it. That part was really fun. I get really anxious, but this has been a really good experience for me. Students not only learned a lot about their own characters, but their classmates as well. A girl, she can do like anything that boys can do because Marie Curie was the first female to ever win a Nobel Prize and the only woman to ever win two Nobel Prizes, so it really, I really look up to her. We work really, really hard in the classroom and it's really fun because we all just get to get together and like help each other out. The sixth grade Living Wax Museum is open to the public. If you missed today's viewing, it will be open tomorrow until lunch. In Pikeville, Shelby Porter, EKB News.